Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Madeline and I am back with some hauls. Not one, not two, but three purchases came in. So um, two of them are beauty and one of them is fashion. So I wanted to actually show you the shoes I got really quick. So um, I got these fabulous things. These are Sorel sandals. Um, I think they are simply terrific. Uh, they have this cool like red part at the back, but look at this sole. It is so cushy, it is so comfy. They are leather on the upper, um, and they look so fun. So I bought these on sale at the Bay, and I also got a gift. They came in this bag, which is filthy, but uh, these are little sandals. So these are gonna be in someone's gift in a few months. So that's a secret. A new place that I ordered from is the shopping channel. And I, I've ordered with them in the past twice, I think, um, but not that often. So let's see what's in these fabulous things. Um, packaging was great, delivery was super fast, and I signed up for their texting updates, which was like insane. It's like, your driver just put the thing into the car. It's like, thank you. Awesome. Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on. This packaging is divine. Wowza. Oh, okay, this is gorgeous. It's the Magnificent Brow Show. Um, this is such a pretty set. So I got one for myself and one as a gift, so I'll just leave the gift one wrapped up. Um, but this is a set of five of their like best-selling brow products. And let me see how this opens up. Oh, it's all sealed. Um, I'm gonna keep it as this because it looks so pretty. There is the Gimme Brow, which is a tinted brow gel with the fibers. There's the Precisely My Brow Pencil, amazing goof-proof brow pencil. Precisely, my brow pencil is very thin, and then the Goof Proof, I believe, is a bit thicker. Um, love them both. So good. And then the 24-hour brow setter gel. Everyone says this is their favorite brow gel, so honestly, it was worth it just for this. But also, one of my absolute ride-or-die products is the Cabrow, and this is a brow pomade. It comes with the brush in the cap. Like, it is so so effortless and really easy once you get the hang of it. I'm wearing it now in the shade three. Um, this is in this uh, number two. I also got three. This will be another gift for ladies who have lighter hair in my life. I got literally the last shade number three, but this is outstanding. It was one of their holiday sets. Um, so if you happen to be able to find it, I'll put the link to the shopping channel below. Oh, I'm so, so happy I picked that up and the packaging is truly divine. Okay, so pièce de résistance, an order from the Bay came in, and again, really fast shipping. Um, they have great customer service too so far. Um, if there's ever a problem, you can give them a call, and actually wait time has not been very long. So I have been waiting to get my hands on, I'm so excited, you guys, you have no idea, some Dior goodies. Oh my gosh, okay, wait, something else. Oh yeah, my gift. First of all, we all know that samples work for me. RMS, now Dior. I got a sample of the Dior, just standard lip glow in the light pink shade. It was in one of those little disposable pots, like the little well, and I kept it on my vanity for so long. I ended up just tossing it because a little goes a long way. But I would just like scoop out a little bit, put it on in the morning, like I was using this little sample like it was pure gold, because to me, this stuff is. So this is a lip balm, similar to the Smashbox O Gloss and O Balm I think they have now. They change with your lip uh, heat and um, they kind of create this really pretty pink flush. So I'm actually wearing a different one today. Winky Lux, this is like a unicorn balm. You can see it's a bit red at the top because that's where I used it. This is pure glitter. It is glimmer. Um, it's really nice, easy to use. I just don't love, like it doesn't smell like much. The texture is okay. I don't like glitter. I don't really find that it plumps my lips at all. It's pretty, it's pink, it's so cute, um, but it's just not my favorite. And I don't like the like taste, it kind of has a plasticky taste to me. My bestie Alana gave me this Too Faced Peach Bloom product. This is brand new, and this is just in the pink shade here. Um, raspberry Flush, again, gorgeous. I don't love the peach scent. I do find it to be kind of plasticky, like she mentioned. Um, that one's also really fun. I'm excited to try out those ones and compare them to these. Guys, this is my ride or die product. It says travel collection, so I don't know what that means, but I ended up getting two of these. It is um, in 004, their lip glow. Oh my god, 
I'm so happy I'm recording this because I'm like, this is just one of the happiest days of my life. Um, I decided to purchase these online at the Bay because although I could have gotten like my Shoppers Optimum points, they've been sold out at Shoppers for a long time. It's perfect. It's perfect, perfect, perfect. So here's the pink. I'll just roll it up a bit. Still need to take photos, so I'm not going to touch them. And then this is the coral. I love coral, so I'm happy they put these two in the kit. There are a few other colors, and again, like glittery, shimmery ones. Um, so that was awesome. I was expecting to just go on and get one of those, the pink. Um, another thing to mention, they moisturize. And this is the type of product where I put it on in the morning, and like at lunch, I'm like, why? how is my lip balm still on? Like, what did I put on? Oh yes, I put on the lip glow balm. It stays, my lips feel plump, because with some of these other ones, uh, like actually the Too Faced was the worst with this, once it wore off, my lips felt dry, you know? They felt dry. It lasted long, but they felt dry. So this does not do it. It truly is a nourishing lip balm. Um, and then I realized that there was a free gift with the purchase of, correction, 150. And I'm like, oh, I'm crazy, I'm not gonna do that. But then I did it. So I got the Dior Backstage gift. This is the second time I've gotten this gift. The first time I got it was in Las Vegas. Rest in peace to traveling. Um, and I got this exact same gift. <laughs> and lash primer, it worked. I bought it, it was amazing. Uh, Dior Lip Maximizer. I have the little sample of it. And um, what do you know? It worked again. The sample size really drew me, drew me the hell in. So I bought two. Oh my God. Like for a girl that has so many lip products, but that's the thing. It really goes to show that I love something if I repurchase it in the full size. So I got the mama and the baby. I love when I can get the mama and the baby products. It's so nice, so cute. Great for traveling. Once again, hopefully it'll happen in the next decade. So I have the Lip Maximizer in the pink, and this is special because I was searching high and low for multiple reviews of this color, um, but I could barely find any. So this is the Lip Maximizer in Rosewood. It's stunning, absolutely stunning. Smells great, doe foot applicator. Again, I put this on like in the car in the morning, and it just stays. It really makes your lips feel plump, but not that tingly, terrible feeling. They look juicy. They look delicious. It's just amazing. The scent and texture is fabulous. I do like spending a bit more on glosses and lipsticks because I feel like they're not made with crap. I love how they feel. I love wearing them. I did see a few photos of this rosewood color. Um, Beauty Lookbook, I think, did a review, but not much. So I'm excited to review this. Hyaluronic Acid Lip Plumper, so, so good. Um, again, I think this pink one does kind of change to your color, um, your natural like warmth or whatever, but it's not as hot pink as this. What really put me over the edge <laughs> was, was the free gift. So I'll show you what's in here. There was a free beauty gift at the Bay. So it comes in this really fun Sherpa pouch. How ridiculous is this? It's kind of cute. Um, so this is a fun little pouch. And all the products are here. Oh, and another bag, good packaging. One thing I'm most excited about is a fragrance mini that's going in my fragrance mini display up there. Um, check out my Instagram if you don't know what I'm talking about. Ooh, face scrub with vitamin C and mint from Jack Black, great for the guys. Advanced night repair from Estee Lauder. We have a um, whipped cleansing cream. I think that's for the face. Wow, this is a big sample of eye cream, eye lift. That'll last a long time. This is fun. Ooh, we have um, a fragrance, NARS Climax Extreme. I haven't tried this one, so that'll be fun. Oh, these are really good, actually, the Retinol Ceramide Capsules. And you know what's funny? I had one of these little tubes that I use for travel. I always keep one of these filled up in my travel case, but I stepped on my other one and broke it. So look, I have a replacement. Hooray! Those are very nice, like, retinol products. Two more perfumes. Honestly, I don't really use those that often, so we'll see if I keep it. Might pass it to my mom. Oh, this is great. Um, a night cream recovery mask, deep recovery mask from Lise Watier. I love their eye cream, actually. It's one of the best, their extreme eye cream. So lovely. Oh my God, there's just a whole whack of samples in here. Okay, I'll go through these very fast. Um, some more skincare here, a Bay Royale. Kiehl's Guerlain, this is a really nice uh, oil. Facial cream, really nice. Hermes perfume, oh, that's new, that's gonna be fun. 
Guerlain perfume. Oh my god, they have so many perfumes. I feel so bad that the counters are closed because I really love going to the counters. Oh, Tiffany. Oh my gosh, there's literally like 15 perfumes in here. That is outrageous. Okay, and then um, more skincare samples here. Shiseido. Oh, that's fun. I had these two products and gifted them away because I just, there's sometimes just too much. Um, okay, this is fabulous. MAC um, Fix Plus and like a little perfume sample. Isn't that fabulous? Okay, travel bag. Hello. All Saints sample and then Clinique. Ooh, that's fun. Their vitamin C powder and a daily booster. Wowza. Okay, so that's everything, you guys. I definitely feel like I got good value here. I also had um, a gift card and, you know, I was just feeling like spoiling myself a little bit. So I'm thrilled. I can't wait to try these on. I'm definitely going to do a review. So again, keep an eye out for that. Let me know if you've really found a product that you love that's expensive and you're just like, you know what, nothing else compares because that's how I feel about these. Like there is, you know, some products, this one from Revlon, their plumping lip cream. It's really good, but as mentioned, nothing lasts and stays on and just feels as fabulous as those glosses. And believe me, I've tried a lot. Um, but if you do want something cheaper, this Revlon plumping lip cream is very beautiful, richly pigmented. I also love the Hard Candy Plumping Lip Gloss that I've talked about a lot on my Instagram. So I'll link everything below. Please follow along, like this video, comment below, and subscribe because there's lots more content coming. Thanks again, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!